What's going on Daytona fans? Welcome back to another video. And in this one, it's going to be how much oil this catch can caught in one year. Now I've owned the car for about a year now, and I've owned the catch can for about the same amount of time. And in that year, I put on 10,200 miles. So let's take a look at how much blow by this 5.7 has. This right here is how much I've caught so far. There's a little bit more in the oil catch can, which I'll show you right now is on the car, which is this guy here. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna empty that out and empty out the contents that are in here and put it into this beer bottle. So this is just your average 12 ounce of beer and I had covered up the label just because, you know, I, I don't want any uh, content strikes or copyright strikes or whatever. But the reason why I'm using that is because I don't know how big this Folgers uh, container is. I don't know what the ounce is. So uh, for me, the beer can is a easier visual because at least I know it's 12 ounces. Um, I, I don't have the markings to let you know how much each uh, ounce is on that beer bottle. But I think we can probably estimate that once it gets all poured in. So why don't I put the camera down, show you what's left, and show you the pour. All right, Daytona fans, here it is. Here is one year's worth of blow-by oil caught from my oil catch can. As you can tell right there, that's the funnel and the Folgers can. It's completely empty. So, we're going to figure out just how much oil there is. Alright, Daytona fans, I've decided to uh, do something a little bit clever. So this is the oil, and this is just uh, water with black food coloring. As you can see, it's not as viscous as the oil. So I decided to do this, and I can pour about this amount into this cup, which would represent how much volume is in here. Um, I don't want to ruin my kitchenware. That's why I have this uh, black water here. This is just something I can wash off. So anyway, this is about the same volume as you can see. Maybe like a hair more, but you know what? It's just about accurate. So this is a representation of how much oil that's in this beer bottle and we're gonna figure out just how much it fills this cup here we go all right there you have it a little bit more than a cup I believe one cup is eight ounces so I guess we can call it you know eight and a half nine ounces worth of oil that has been collected over the year all right, Daytona fans, that's how much oil I was able to collect in about 10,200 miles. Now, my driving varies from yours. I went on eight road trips, one of which was to South Carolina, which was about 1,700 miles round trip. And I've been on the drag strip once. I've driven it almost daily up until the winter. And so uh, my driving is mostly city, a little bit of highway, and aside from... Uh, you know, when I get to open it up, I really don't do too much aggressive driving. So with that in mind, I was able to collect about eight and a half ounces of oil, and that's for the 5.7. Now, if you're looking at the 6.4 or the supercharged 6.2 Hemis, I'm pretty sure you'll get a little more than eight ounces, maybe even nine or ten, because those engines are bigger, which means there's more blow-by. So if you're ever on the fence about whether you should get an oil catch can or not, or, or whether you think it's worth it, I think it is. You know, about eight and a half ounces of oil that would have gone back into your intake that would have clogged up your valves. And eventually, if there was never a catch can, it would have sludged up the valves. It would have caused problems down the line. All right, Daytona fans, it has been a pleasure talking to you. And I hope you found this educational and entertaining at the same time. If you haven't already, please subscribe, like, and comment down below. Let me know if you have an oil catch can and how much oil you've caught, or maybe you don't believe in an oil catch can. I'd, I'd love to share a discussion with you. And of course, until the next one, have a great day. Peace.
Hellcat shirt. Yeah!